What's up YouTube? It is me, Smooth Grilled C, and today we're going to be taking a look at logic gates. So basically, logic gates are a way of using redstone circuits in a way that certain combinations of inputs or redstone signals will achieve a certain output. So this first one that we're going to look at is the NOT gate. It's basically an inverter. Um, when I flick the switch to the OFF position, the light comes on. Switch it to the ON position, the light goes off. And you know, it's real simple. We're going to go ahead and build one right now. It's a block with a lever, a redstone torch, redstone dust coming out of the torch, and a redstone lamp. So, you turn it off, the lamp comes on. Turn it on, the lamp comes off. This next gate is the AND gate. The, the AND gate is used with two or more switches or other inputs. Um, the output is toggled to ON only when both switches or inputs are toggled to ON. Um, otherwise it's off. So if I put one on and the other on, the light comes on. One's off, it's off. If both are off, it's off. We'll go ahead and build this one up real quick too. So you're going to want two switches, redstone torches, right there, there, and there. Your redstone dust connecting them up and your redstone dust for your output. So both are on, it's on, off. Or both are on, it's on. One's on, one's off, it's off. And now let's take a look at the NAND gate. Um, it's the opposite of the AND gate. It's toggled to OFF only when both switches are toggled to ON. So if we turn both ON, the light turns off. Turn one off, it comes on. Let's go ahead and build this one up. So again, you need two switches. You'll put your torches on top, redstone dust coming out like that, and then your lamp. So let's turn one it's still on, turn the other, it's still on, but if we turn both, it turns off. Now this is the OR gate. The OR gate is whenever any input is on, the input is on. So if we turn this one on, it comes on. We turn this one on, it comes on. If we turn both on, obviously it's on. So let's go ahead and build this one up. It's real simple. Two switches, your redstone dust, and your lamp. Now let's take a look at the NOR gate. It's the opposite of the OR gate. Uh, whenever one switch is on, the output is off. The only time the output is on is when both inputs are off. So, turn both on, but turn both off and it comes on. So, this one's real simple as well. 
a block, put both your switches on it, torch in the back, and your output. You can also put, you know, dust, make your output longer. There you go. Now let's take a look at the, the XOR gate. The output is on when one switch is on and when one switch is off. If both switches are in the same position, it'll always be off. So one's on, it's on, one, one, there you go. This one is a little bit more complicated, but it's still fairly easy. So, get out of here. <clears throat> Your two inputs, redstone torch, and redstone dust. Then we'll come around to this side and we'll put three more torches. We'll put dust here, here, going up into blocks, here and here, with more dust on top of the blocks, torches on the back of the blocks, and your output. One on and one off and the light comes on. Now this is the X NOR gate. It's the opposite of the or the 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 XOR gate. When both switches are in the same position, then the output is on. If the switches differ, the output is off. So it's off right now because I have one on and one off. We'll turn them both off the light comes on. We'll turn them both on, the light comes on. This is another complicated one, but it won't kill you. So, you'll start out, it's almost, it's, it's almost the same. You'll start out with your blocks and your, your levers. You'll put redstone torches and dust and let me look at this one again okay block here redstone dust on top three more torches redstone dust on the sides blocks with the redstone dust going up, redstone torches on the back of those, redstone dust in between them, and going up a block with a torch, and your output. Jeez, my dogs are out there fighting. So, they're both on, light comes on. They're both off, light comes on. And the last one we're going to take a look at is the only gate. Now this one's unique. Um, the output is only on when the first one is on and the second one is off. So if both are on or both are off, it won't come on. And if this one's on and this one's off, it won't come on. But if you turn this one on, it'll come on. Turn this one on, it goes off. So this one's pretty simple as well. You, you need two levers. redstone torch coming out of the back of the first one and it's a, and you can switch it up by inverting this 
if you put the redstone torch over on this side and not on this side, it'll it'll be the other way around where this one is the the main one. So then you want to put your dust down like this into a block with a torch on the back of it and your output. So if I turn this one on, light comes on. Turn this one on, light goes off. Turn this one off and this one on, lights off. Let's turn them both off. No light, but if I turn this one on, the light comes on. And there you go. These are all the basic logic gates. If you guys have any questions, leave them down in the comments and I will try my best to answer them in a timely fashion um, yeah so I had to do a lot of research for this because I only knew like three or four of these and I knew there was more out there and I knew that they were you know really handy and so Making this video has definitely improved my redstone skills, and I hope watching this has helped you out as well. If you guys got something out of this video, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. I will be making more redstone videos. Um, we're going to be going over all the circuits, all the, all the fun stuff. So, leave a like, don't forget to subscribe, and comment down below if there's anything I can help you out with. See you guys in the next video.